Hey everyone, and this is Darkside, and I'm making a video on how to install a private server for World of Warcraft. A friend asked me to do it because he doesn't know how to, so we're going to do it, I guess. First thing you're going to need is you're going to need BitTorrent, or any type of torrenting situation. No matter what, you're going to need it. Um, I recommend BitTorrent. Then you're going to need the website, which I'll have in the link below, maltandwow.com, and you're going to want to go to the download link, which we'll, I'll put there. You're going to want to register, and then you're going to have to verify it, normal server stuff, normal gaming, actually. Your next thing is, do what, so, what realm do you want to be on? On the right side, there's realms. There's Cataclysm, Wrath of the Lich King. And then there's multiple for each one, which, it's normal. So really, you just decide, remember it is a private server, so it might not be fully up to date. They are working as best they can, but let's go off and I'm going to download Cataclysm. So you just click the magnet. It'll ask to open with BitTorrent or whatever you have, yes. And then we just wait for my BitTorrent. And there you go. Simply save the desktop. And it's as simple as that. And now you just have to let it wait and record. So we'll wait until this is done. Alrighty, now while it's doing this, you're going to see that it's downloading. Simple as that. Um, I set mine to desktop, so it'll be fine but basically it's going to take however the ETA is the estimated time and that's how long it's going to take for it to finish once that's done if you've never used BitTorrent before I'm explaining this to you if anyone has then this really doesn't apply to you it's going to download minus 20 minutes left so it's not that big of a thing um, once it's done it'll be set to wherever you set it as I put mine on desktop and I'll show you how you can go to yours from this in a second whenever it's done. Alrighty, now the next part is pretty simple. Um, seeding. Yeah, you can seed, but you don't have to. If you want to, just right click it, then click stop. It's pointless. I don't know why. I mean, yeah, it helps out other people who download it, but if you're not willing to do that, then just stop it. Then you're going to right click it. If you don't know where you saved it to, let's say you were doing it too quickly, you are going to want to open containing folder, which is the third button. Once you do that, it's going to open where you have it saved. And that's pretty simple. I think I clicked it. If I didn't, well, I have it down here. So it opens the folder. And then from this folder, son of a bitch, open too. And then from this folder, you're going to have four WinZip files which I did not remember earlier, you're going to need some type of extracting. As you can see, just right clicking it and then look. And it's going to say whenever it fuck whenever it, I'm not going to cuss, whenever it loads. It'll say you can do extract here, WinRAR is what I use, then there's WinZip and then there's 7zip. No, it doesn't matter how you do it, just extract all four files at the same time. And there you go. And then the next part will be how to play it and everything else. But when it's extracting, you're going to see, waiting for it to pop up. I don't know how long it's going to take to pop up, because well, it might just be because it's loading four parts, but still. Um, well, while I wait for it to load, little thing, if you hear me breathing heavy, it's because I'm sick at the moment. And it's just that. Oh, yeah, there we go. It's extracting. And there's the thing. There you go. Now you just have to wait the time left, which for me, it's, dear God, two hours. So, I'll, oh, maybe it'll go down. But I'll continue the video in an hour and a half. All right. Alrighty. And for the final piece, once it's done extracting, you're going to have a bunch of things in the folder that you extracted it to. Now you're going to want to click the one that's highlighted. Wow. World of Warcraft Retail Blizzard Entertainment. It's the wow symbol. You just double click it. And this is when it's bit rate that you're about to play. That's really it. You pop it up. You see right here, you're looking at it. When you're looking at it, where it says enter your email address, what, do not, this, cannot stress this enough, do not put your email address. You will put your, oh, wow, pff, thank you for telling me that. You're going to put your username. Now, your username could be anywhere from like, omager29, I don't care. It's your username that you signed up on Molten Wow. So it's not only is your username, it's your Molten Wow username. And your password, your password. That's as simple as that. 
when you use your Mountain Wild username and your password, you're going to log in. It's going to bring you to a server list. You join the server, and then you create your ca private server character. That's literally as easy as it is. If you have any problems whatsoever, feel free to contact me on the video in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe and watch some of our other videos. Thanks for watching. I'm Darkside, signing out.